Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to easily shoot and edit a realistic car scene in Adobe After Effects. Let's get started. First I put a camera on a tripod. Then I place the green screen behind my head since there is a lot of movement. Other windows can be easily masked out because we are shooting this on a tripod. And of course we also need to shoot a background which we're gonna insert in the windows. Once we have all shots let's open up After Effects. So I already placed the green screen video on the timeline. First things first, I'll mask out all windows. So select the pen tool and start drawing masks around the windows. Since we want to remove the inside of these masks, set the mask blending mode to subtract. Then do the same for each window. Now we are only left with the green screen window. To remove the green screen search for key light effect and apply it to the green screen layer. Select the green color with color picker. Then change the view to screen matte and adjust the settings. I prefer to use intermediate result and then apply advanced spill suppressor effect because it will remove the green spill. At this stage we can insert the background behind the windows. So drag the video in the timeline and place it below the green screen layer. Also reposition it to match the perspective. Now it is looking quite good already, but there are still some things we can do to make it look more realistic. First I'm gonna fix the colors. So I created an adjustment layer and applied Lumetri color effect to it. I also recommend to adjust the background color separately. Additionally, I created a white solid layer and placed it below the green screen car shot. Then play around with the opacity. This will make the windows look a bit more faded or misty and that gives it a natural look. I used feathered masks as well to affect just a certain area. The last step is adding movement. Precompose the layers and open position. I'm gonna use a simple wiggle expression. Hold down Alt and click the stopwatch icon. Next type in wiggle and use frequency and amplitude you like. Finally adjust the scale and that's it. If you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one.